What is going on everybody? We are out here for a lovely Sunday ride right now. And I've been trying to go uh, different places every time when I do a vlog. I don't want to just keep riding through the same places. So this is uh, where we're at right now today. There is a left up here I'm going to be taking. Never been down this road. I've been on this road I'm on. Oh, it's actually really low. Wow. And no idea where we're going to end up other than it goes around the reservoir. So, hope everyone is having a fantastic day today. Again, never been down this road, no idea. Haven't seen a speed limit actually posted yet. So we're just going to go for a lovely cruise around the reservoir. So the last video I did, I did a video about um, what I love and what I hate. There actually wasn't a lot of hate on this bike. I, I really do love it. There, there's things I don't like. The brakes are really good. The suspension's good. The suspension is soft though. So that that's something that should be addressed. Uh, and the throttle can be a little bit snatchy, especially in first, sometimes second, not always. It did smooth out a bit once I got my first service done. So we're just out here enjoying this, this perfect day. I, it's like 70 out right now. The sun's starting to poke through some of the clouds. Gorgeous road. And yeah, can't, can't beat it can't beat it so and there's no traffic even better but that's what we're up to today and like I started saying I'm trying to find different spots watch out for the gravel which I actually thought looking at it I thought this there might actually be gravel on this road so I was like well we might be in for a little bit of an adventure today not not quite well Anyways, this is the, the Tom Hannock Reservoir. It's drinking water. You can fish here. It is, however, um, you, you need a permit from the city on top of uh, your regular fishing license. So, there is that. Apparently, there's some good walleye in here. I, I've never fished up here. I have no idea. That's what I've heard. That's what I've read. And yeah, so we're trying to find different spots to ride. So I'm having to go, I, this isn't too far from me, but every day I'm, every time I do a vlog, not every day, every time I do a vlog, I'll say it, it's gonna be going a little bit further, a little bit further. And you know, the nice thing is like different direction every time. So that is nice. I, usually I can only go the same way, like, two or three times before I run out of places that I've already been with increasing the distance a certain amount so so we're actually going to pull over real quick and there is an issue I want to discuss with y'all about this and I haven't had a chance to go to the dealer yet hopefully Monday will be the day for that hopefully that's going to be the day uh, I was going to go last week, I uh, couldn't actually take the bike because it was downpouring. And I don't know how well this is going to pick it up on the camera. So, if, if you look right here, right here around the top of this, I don't know if it's going to, oh, you can kind of see it on the bottom right there too. I do, it is rusting behind this. I think it's actually this piece rusting, I don't think it's the fork, but being I've only had the bike since May, that is something and it's rusting on the other side as well it's just easier to see on this side um being as though i've only had this bike since may and i have how many miles 2000 22.99 on it you know that is something i i feel like it shouldn't be rusting already uh so i want to see if there's anything they can do to uh help me out and, and possibly get that addressed before it gets any worse and the other thing i want to talk about is oh i got a starter 
is my fuel mileage. My average right now is 57.4 is what I've been averaging with this. Oop, keep, there we go. So, and that's uh, mostly, I do a lot of riding. Oh, I hate this with the sticks and crap. Bam, 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 bam. there we go, all right. It's it, 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 like I commute. I commute almost every day. I have a very short commute, but I commute to work almost every day on this. And it's great, but lately the weather's been crap, so I haven't been able to actually go for a ride. This is the first time I've been able to like actually go out for a ride in a while. In probably like the last two weeks. Because every time I get a weekend, it's the, the weather's crap. Either it's raining all day or there's on and off showers and thunderstorms, which I have been caught in. Uh, so that's another thing with the rust right there. I've washed the bike a handful of times. Usually I just hit it with some quick detailer. I've got a, a spray wax that I use. And usually that's more than enough to, to get it cleaned up really good. So there's that. I've washed it a handful of times. And I got caught in the rain once. That was for my first time riding and, and you know getting caught in the rain. It was actually it wasn't it wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I wasn't like sliding all over the place or slipping and no, nothing like that. It was fine. It was just really wet. Uh, I was not I was not wearing my gear. I was just in a pair of pants and a t-shirt and it was wet. And let me tell you, the rain stings quite bad. So that's that that was a thing. What is, what is all that? No idea. So that was the thing. I don't recommend it. You know, try not to do it again. And I, I checked the weather. The weather looked great. The, the rain was done for the day. Everything was drying out. And I was like, perfect. I went out. I got to where I was going. And then had to come back. And coming back, I go, oh, that does not look good. So I decided to go the other way and try to go around it. Which apparently was a worse idea because I got caught in all of it. So. So that, that wasn't fun. That didn't work out. But it's not horrible if, if you get caught in the rain don't panic it, it's really not that bad just take it easy and you'll be fine what is this road I have no idea and really I, I, I don't know where I'm actually going right now which is one of the things I like to do uh, with with the bike you just go i'll go for a ride and go i'm i'm gonna go this way and see wherever you end up it's awesome it, it's not something i do in a car i also don't try to look for roads like this in a car well sometimes i do depending on what i'm driving i like to look for roads like this but for the most part you know if you're going somewhere in a car you know what what's the fastest most direct way to get there usually it's the highway and you end up taking the highways so it's one of the great things about bikes it, it'll get you out it'll get you exploring going places you probably have never been and would never think to go so just want to throw that out there too and and address the issue about vlogs uh again you know trying to find new places to ride for for the vlogs every time i just i i, I know they're boring I at least don't want the scenery. I would like to to at least have different scenery every time. So that's what I'm trying for. Uh, that's also part of the reason, along with the weather, why I'm not actually doing that many vlogs. Although I don't have a lot of time left because it is getting to be the end of August. So I don't have a whole lot of time left where I'm gonna be able to ride. I got another month and a half, two months hopefully.
that I'm going to be able to ride before it just gets too cold and it's not really worth the risk up here to, to ride. So I'm going to try to stock up on vlogs a little bit. I, I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens there. And then, yeah. So that's about it. Uh, the rust, the vlogs, new places to ride. And just having a good time on the bike and talking about exploring a little bit. Which way are we going to go? I think we'll, we'll go left. Sounds good to me. So. Oh, 35. So that's going to be it for the vlog today. And yeah, you know, uh, I will keep everyone posted. Let you know how the rust makes out, uh, how it make out with the dealer on Monday. See what they say, see what happens. And until the next one, I hope everyone has a fantastic day and enjoy the sunshine while you can. Peace out.